everyone, Megan here, and I am Jesse. <laughs> Friends, I have a story to introduce today's Bible story. A story about Jesse, me. Yep. What is it? Okay, let me tell everyone. You know how much Jesse loves his new bike? Yes, my Galactic Theater Acer 20 inch trail bike. <laughs> yes, that's the one. Well, Jesse's little brother rode Jesse's bike without his permission and got a flat tire. But instead of getting mad, Jesse showed his brother mercy and told him he could ride his bike anytime. Isn't that cool? Ah, oh, thanks, Megan. Yeah, well, I, I started to get mad, but I asked God to help me, and he did. That is a good story. <laughs> yes, it's an awesome story, Jesse. I'm so proud of you. In today's Bible story, David showed mercy to someone too. Let me tell you about it. David was hiding in the hills. He had served King Saul and won many battles, but now Saul was jealous of David and wanted to kill him. Saul went looking for David. David and his men were hiding in the back of a cave when Saul happened to pass by. Saul decided to go inside the cave. David's men saw Saul. Look, they said, God said he would give you your enemy. This is the day. You can do whatever you want to him. David got close to Saul and secretly cut off the corner of Saul's robe. Saul did not see David. After that, David felt upset about what he had done. He told his men, I will not fight the king. God chose him. Saul left the cave and went on his way. David followed him and called out, My lord, the king! Saul turned around and David knelt low before him. Why do you think I'm trying to hurt you? David asked. Look, I had a chance to hurt you, but I showed mercy. David showed Saul the corner of the robe that he had cut. Saul began to cry. <laughs> you are more righteous than I, Saul said, because you have done what is good to me, even though I have done what is evil to you. Most people would hurt an enemy, but you have let me go. May God reward you for being kind. Saul knew God was with David and that David would be the king of Israel. Saul said, promise me you will not hurt my family when you are king. So David promised. Then Saul went home and David and his men went back to the hills. David showed mercy to Saul, his enemy, because David trusted God's plan. Jesus trusted his father's plan too. He died on the cross so his enemies could have God's mercy and live forever as part of God's family.